Hey, hey, it's Filet, and this is my garage. And I want to show you a little project that I'm working on today. This is my crankshaft off of my Porsche 912 that I'm redoing the motor on. And I wanted to show you, I'm going to do a little micro polishing on the crankshaft. I've seen other people do it on big V8 crankshafts, but I haven't seen anybody post it on YouTube for a 912. Anyways, what I've done is I've taken some six grit, 600 grit um, wet dry sandpaper and some WD 40. And what I do is I just make sure this is nice and soaked. You see I cut it in a strip. It's about the width of the journal. And I also soak that really well. And then what we'll do here is we'll wrap this around. And then we'll take the shoelace that I have. that I just happen to have laying around as one of my daughter's Doc Martin boots. But anyways, I somehow found it in my toolbox. So seems to work. A lot of people like to use a flat shoelace off of a roller skate or something because it's got a bigger, you know, wider footprint to it so you get better coverage. So anyways, this one thing will go around here twice and you want to make sure you stay, you keep the paper up underneath it. And then it takes a couple seconds to get it rolling but once you get your groove down, I think I need to go around here one more time. And the whole objective is to keep the sandpaper as loose as possible so it can rotate. And then here you go. And so this crankshaft, this motor seemed to be pretty low mileage and it looked like it broke a valve. And, I mean, it broke a piston ring and got into the valve and made a ticking noise. And when they tore it apart, they tore around the wrong side. And it kind of just sat in a scrap pile for the longest time. And in like 2009, I met this guy, saw the motor, and he gave it to me. So I threw it in the back of my truck. and. Who would have known that five years later I'd have a little 912 to put together. So anyways, I just, you can see, just WD-40, some 600 grit, and about a minute and a half, two minutes of just going back and forth. You'd be surprised how clean the surface comes. As you can see, I should have done a zoom in, but the journals were pretty black and had some marring on it, but didn't seem to have any really deep scratches. So... Like I said, saw it online, they were using 400 grit, and you know, I didn't want to tear mine up because this is standard, standard low mileage, so I started with 800, and it was a little bit too soft, so I went to the 6, and like I said, about a minute and a half, two minutes, you pull this apart, and this one's going to need a little bit more, but as you can see, you know, for just a couple of minutes I spent on it, that cleans up nicely. You can see all the marring is gone. You can see the other journal here, what it looked like. It was pretty messed up. Got just a couple more to go. And then I'll do the same thing to my camshaft. And hopefully, pretty soon, we'll be able to get this case put together. But anyways, here you have it. You can see I'm doing a little test fitting on everything. Got my rods all ready to go. Bearings are out. So it's not going to be too much longer. Everything's bagged and tagged, ready to go back together. And then, so then I might as well show you this. I don't know how good it's going to look in the dark, but. Yeah, that doesn't look good. Anyways, Porsche 912 crankshaft polishing. Do it yourself. This is Gilby, or this is actually Filet in Filet's garage. Have fun. Please subscribe.